The Olympics were officially postponed today. There is not a firm rescheduled date, but the games will not happen in 2020. In fact, I helped out the IOC by changing the logo. You know, if they want to send me an email and buy that from me, feel free. It is, however, a huge blow to many athletes who sacrifice quite a bit to take a run at sports' ultimate stage, including one Rochesterian that A.J. Feldman talked with today. Yanni Diakamahalis of Hilton took a year off of wrestling at Cornell to train specifically for the Olympic Games. Now he'll have to wait a bit longer after it was announced that the Olympic Games were getting pushed to next year. Less than three weeks ago, Diaco Mahalis was in Canada, winning the gold medal at the Pan Am Wrestling Championships. But that's also about the time things start to change around the wrestling world. They started canceling stuff around the world, you know, that was when Italy started getting bad, and then they canceled the NCAA wrestling tournament, and that was a big foreshadowing to me that, you know, maybe Olympic trials or Olympic Games were going to get canceled or postponed. Today, the official word came out, the 2020 Games would be in 2021. It was a disappointing blow to Yaka Mahalis and everyone in the athletic community. You peak, you prepare, you know, you're spending your whole, whole year, you know, months. All this time you've dedicated your life for this, you know, two week, you know, weekend in April and weekend in August for the Olympics and all the trials. And then to finally get canceled, it's really disappointing. The former Hilti cadet has won four high school titles, two NCAA championships. But to be able to represent your country on the biggest stage, that's his dream. That's like the ultimate goal. Like if you can come home with a gold medal from the Olympic Games, that's that's like the pinnacle. It's the peak to me. You know, it's you beat the best guys in the world on their best day. Diaka Mahalis agrees with the decision to postpone the games, and as a younger wrestler, waiting one more year might actually help him in the long run. He try to just look at the silver lining. You know, it's only a year from now, and if we're being honest, that's much closer to my physical prime. You know, I mean, I'm, I'm still young, still developing. Diak Mahalas is now focused on staying in shape, and with all the gyms closed in the area, he'll be training in the gym in his garage against local wrestlers, including his younger brother, Greg, who just finished his high school career with a fifth state title. In the studio, A.J. Feldman, News 8.